Hearts are apparently set to add a third Australian to the club. They're looking at a new signing, Kai Rolls from Central Coast Marinas. And uh, I'm, I've got one thing to say. I'm, I'm not giving this guy the stampy approval till he shaves off that tash. I mean, let's be real, guys. Having a, a tash like that, a Hitler tash is bad enough. But when it's ginger... Then that's just a double no for me. That's a red card. This guy shouldn't be getting signed to Hearts contract until that thing goes, mate. So put a wee bit of Gillette on it, give it a shave, and then we can maybe talk about you getting a contract and potentially coming to Edinburgh. But don't be coming to Edinburgh rocking a ginger Hitler-style tash like that, because that will get you fucking nowhere. Um, as for the player himself, don't know a lot about him. Kyle Rolls. I don't know. But what I can say is the recruitment over the past couple of years with Joe Savage and... Uh, Nielsen as the manager has been really good. Everybody were brought in pretty much. Well, not everybody. That's a stretch. Their non jelly was pretty shit. Not gonna lie. Like, but uh, no. Recently, I think the past two seasons, most players that were brought in, I found have been, you know, pretty good. Um, especially the Australians. I'm like a big fan of Cameron Devlin. I think Ben Atkinson's had a pretty good season, albeit a lot of people are questioning him for his performance in the Scottish Cup final. It wasn't his greatest game. I'll admit that. Um, debates whether he was at fault for the goals. Maybe, maybe. I think he was definitely fouled though. I think he was fouled for the second. But, I mean, regardless, I think overall they have been good players. So who knows? Maybe that's going to be the new thing. Maybe we're just going to poach players from Australia. You know, and just got his thing where he's going to bring in the Japanese boys. Maybe we're going to bring in, you know, maybe we're going to bring in the Australian boys. Who knows? It could be a thing. Um, like, Aberdeen seem to be bringing in, like, North American lads. So, maybe each club is going to try and bring in players from, like, a certain region or a certain nationality. So, I mean, who knows? Uh, what are Hibs going to do? Are they going to bring in San Marino players because they're shite? Is that what Hibs are going to do? Hibs are going to be the new San Marino club team? I uh, don't know. But as for this guy, who knows? I mean, I just want to see us make signings. Now, Robbie Nielsen has already basically come out and said it's going to be a big season. We've got Europe. We will need to make a lot of signings. We'll need to make quality signings. We need to, you know, improve the depth for the squad. That makes perfect sense. We do. Because, you know, we struggled this season. And it was just domestic for us. And we did struggle at times with a, you know, a, a pretty small squad. So you add in the European games, you add in playing on the Thursday nights, and we are going to be stretched. So we definitely need to make signings. And we need to make quality signings. We need to make players that can come in and, you know, pretty much play in the first team, play in the first 11. It's no good signing players just to warm the bench because we're going to need these players at some point during the season. And not only will we need them, I think we want to improve the squad. Yeah, we're the third best team in Scotland, but... Let's be real, everyone else last season was kind of shit, so we want to cement that, and we want to push forward, we don't want to rest on third place, we don't want to think, uh, you know, we're, we're a lot better than the other teams, because I mean, that can easily change over a transfer window, so I would expect the teams behind us to get better, so we need to get better, therefore, to try and, you know, keep the gap between ourselves and them, so, yeah, just a quick bit of news here, Kyle Rose, is he coming to hearts, who knows, we'll, we'll wait, we'll see, but uh, apparently hearts are looking at him, so... Should be interesting to see if this goes through. And uh, yeah, two days away for the World Cup semi-final playoff. Oh man, if, if we win that, then expect a shitload more feds. I'll, I'll, date, I'll make me a feds on Hearts Transfer News. But if we lose that, then I'll probably never be seen again. I'll probably never upload again. I'll probably delete both the channels. So hopefully Scotland get the job done. Anyway guys, that's it. Till next time. Ginger, fucking the Ginger Hitler is coming to Hearts. Peace.